quickly because Steve is really. I'm seeing a lot of other names too, though. That's good. Come on, Coco Jones. Beyonce, we already know it's a given. It's like you don't even need to say Beyonce. It's like, the, wait a minute. You know what we need to get into? That new Ice Spice song. I got to show love to my girl because she be giving me, she be hitting it with that little one move. Why does she love that move? Y'all know that move I'm talking about. Why did Miss Mama do that move all the time? <laughs> Miss Mama's be like, wait a minute. <laughs> Why does Miss Mama stay doing this right here? Why does Miss Mama love that move? Y'all, are you guys? <laughs> Y'all know good and well. Miss Mama's need to trademark that move because Miss Mama loves that move, yo. We gotta play that new that new Ice Spice song. Who, what's the name of the new song, y'all? What is the name of that? Cause I need to play this. Let me see. I gotta find this new this new. Let me see. Ice Spice. I wanna get into it with y'all. Ice Spice. What is it, y'all? Who is with it? Who is with her? Oh, Princess. It's her and who? Princess, y'all said. Princess Diana. Oh, Princess Diana, boo. Princess Diana. Let's see it. Let's see what it's giving, y'all. Let's see what it's giving. Okay. Stop playing with them, right? Like, keep it a stack. Smooth walk, say, no, I got beans. Shine out, don't give a damn. I'm still getting money. I know who I am. Y'all know what else? She be dancing, she be standing like this. Y'all know what I'm talking about, how she be standing. I gotta do my camera, hold on. She be like... <laughs> what? When he brushing his teeth, okay. He think about me when he brushing his teeth. Uh, period. My baby in my stomach like this. Period. Okay, it's cute. It's cute. It's cute, guys. It's not the one that I was thinking, though. I don't think. I don't know if this is the one, guys. Because the one that I'm talking about... Wait a minute. I'm going to try to find it real quick. Because I'm like... I heard it earlier and it was just giving me something different and new. Here it is. This is the one I'm talking about. So I tell him it's one of me. He making fun of me. His girl is a bum of me. I like that boy is a cat. See, he home, but I know where he at. Like, but he throwing her back. Think about me, cause I know that it's fat. Yeah. And they doing what it been. I'm falling in his phone like you'll send me a pen. Look at my shit, cause he know what I want. But when he hit me, I'm not gonna respond. But I don't sleep enough without you. And I can't eat enough without you. If you don't speak, does that mean we're through? Don't like sticky Oh, it's over. I just played like it was a snippet. But that right there was what I was rocking with. I heard the little clip. And I said, okay, girl. I said, okay, girl. Oh, why is my camera doing this? Stop playing with me. Don't blow me. I was like, okay, girl. But anyway, I'm rocking with that. Not somebody talking about coochie grab. What's coochie grab? Um... Oh yeah, exactly. That's it. Yeah, Miss Girl, I live for that. She needs to. She needs to license that cooch grab, honey. Because I mean, everybody been doing the cooch grab, but she she just do it every time so much that we be just like, yes. Um, let me put my little get back into my vibes so we can be listening to some music while we talk, honey. But anyway, we need you to say the Star Queens. I know. I live for Star. They just, they just push our little show to the side, honey. Y'all know how I be. We be back with another show. Think of you. When I, when I. When's the Grammys? I don't know. I don't be watching them too much. I mean, I do think they're great. You know, I'm, my boy Chris, uh, Chris uh, 
Tricky Stewart. I was about to say Chrissy Stewart because his name is Christopher Tricky Stewart. But he's nominated. Shout outs to him. Um, I can't fly right now, so I'm not I'm really only on the East Coast for now. What y'all been watching on TV? Do y'all be watching TV? Don't y'all feel like in today's day, people are always like so quick to be like, oh, TV, I don't have time for it. It's like, girl, what you be doing for real? Like, everybody is like, oh, TV, I just, <laughs> TV, I, I, I don't have time. It's like, well, then find the damn time, girl, to watch some damn TV. Um, Y'all watch a lot of TV. I'm rocking with it. So I definitely watch Abbott Elementary. Love the show. Also, Last of Us, I didn't want to get into it. Darius had me getting into it, child, and now I love the show. Now I'm sitting there back. What a zombie at? What a zombie at? And my thing with The Last of Us is they have that them things looking really disgusting. Have you guys ever watched it? They looking disgusting. They're looking disgusting to the point of no return. Like uh, whether their heads are like splitting open and everything like that. I don't. I don't rock with it. Not one bit. Disgusting. What else I've been watching? Proud family. <laughs> hey, hey. Oh my gosh, you guys. I'm so. I gotta be honest with you guys. I'm not scared about a lot of stuff, right? I'm not. I'm not scared about a lot of things. A lot of things don't ner don't make me nervous. I really be chilling. You know, I'm very I'm I'm a Virgo, you know, I'm I'm a pretty strong person, whatever you want to call it. I know everybody's with the soft girl life, but look, I can be strong and soft at the same time. I really don't have any any, any here nor there about that strong life soft life whatever the life needs to be for me to survive get it to it but I say all this to say I was with my doctor the other day I was in my doctor's office the other day and we're talking about the size of my baby at this point in time we're talking about the pounds on my baby right and this man says, you know, he's on the point of being in a good pounds. You know, he's on the point of being good pounds, everything like that. You know what I mean? Um, not too big, not too small. Because some of these docs, some of these uh people, you know, these the men are like, yes, I got me a 10-pound baby. And then their wife's, uh, their wife's vagina looks like a bomb went off. And I'm like, excuse me? Excuse me? Looking like a bomb went off? And all I've been thinking about since that man said that, and my doctor, he's real as hell. He's such a nice man, right? But he comes in, like, for instance, early on in my pregnancy, he was asking me, like, has the baby been kicking? And, I'm, and, and, and I'll say this. English is not my doctor's first, first language. But my doctor, I'm like, you know, talking to him and everything. And he's like, you know, um, you know, Kiki, uh, had the baby been moving? And I'm like, yeah, the baby been moving. Everything's been going good. And um, he moves so much, and he's very active. He's like, yes, I know I know that you're probably thinking that the movement means something, but right now, at this point in time, you still have a generic baby. I'm like, a generic baby? <laughs> I'm like, wait a minute, <laughs> sir. What do you mean I have a generic baby? Like, what does generic baby mean? <laughs> he's like, you have a generic baby. Um, right now, pretty much telling me my baby didn't have no soul yet. He's like, that baby is not real. That baby in there right now is just a robotic baby. That baby's a generic baby. He doesn't think. He doesn't move. <laughs> he doesn't. All his movements are just in his room sleep. And I'm like, nah, that ain't that about a bitch. You, I'm over here excited about this movement, and you're telling me that the baby's generic? So that was the first time that I knew my doctor wasn't going to hold back with me. So then he talked about this boom choom looking like a bomb went off. And guys, all I'm thinking about... I don't want my boom tune to look like a bomb went off. I don't want this to bust me up like that. Anybody in here had kids? Oh. Guys, anybody in here had kids? Because that's scary. Y'all know that that's scary. Could you imagine waking up and just looking there and just being like, I remember when you used to be cute. That's not right. That's not right. I'm going to let y'all know today. <laughs> if I'm ripped up after this, if I look like I was just hit by a train, you best believe your girl is getting reupholstered. Because I didn't come into this world like this. You know, that's not right. Why do I have to suffer? You know, I don't want to suffer because of this, you know. 
That's not good. That's not fair to me. So if, if, if I end up looking like a train wreck, just know it ain't going to last but a few days, y'all. Because I'm going to get my stuff fixed. Period. I ain't going to let this... <laughs> Why not watch your movies? That's crazy. Some of these tweets be hilarious, y'all. These people be writing some crazy tweets. Anyway, that's just upsetting to me. So I've been thinking back and forth about all this stuff. You know what I'm saying? I've been thinking about all this stuff. Like I said, I have no shame in getting real poster, honey, from top to bottom, honey, top to bottom. I'm also not going to deal with these ladies talking about, oh, careful with the breastfeeding. You know, if it turns into a flapjack, honey, I'm going to get it blowed up again because <laughs> I'm not dealing with it. I'm not dealing with it. Uh-uh. I don't, it's not right. And we can cut it out. With all of the talk about the, you know, at the end of the day, I didn't come into this world this way. So I'm not leaving out looking like a flapjack with a blown up boom chunk. That's not what I'll be dealing with. And that's just it, bottom line. So we, if we're going to judge me, judge me now. But even better than that, if you don't know me by now, then you ain't going to know me because I ain't doing it. So that's, that's that on that. We could just, we could already put that out there like, boom. Kiki ain't going to do that. Boom. Kiki going to look good. She, she ain't going to let this tear her up. So, boom. We can put that out there. Period. Now, the other thing is this whole tube in your back gag. The whole epidural tube in your back gag. You know, girls been telling me that, oh, I have had back I, I my, my sciatica. I have incredible sciatica now because of this. I'm just like, it don't seem like you can escape anything. And then I, I talked to my doctor because I was Googling on there. Y'all, why was I Googling that? You know, they have a bunch of different options. Let me just show you how America is, right? So, in America, you could get an epidural, which we all know is like the tube thing going in your back. You know what I'm saying? You could obviously always do natural birth, which is just no anesthesia at all. Or you can do morphine. I want y'all to sit on that. You could, you, could be, you, you could be up in there looking for the hair on. Um, but what you can't do... Is have a um what's the word I'm looking for? What you can do is laughing gas. Now get into this. You can do morphine over here in America, but you can't do laughing gas. They do apparently they doing laughing gas, y'all. The gag is they over there doing laughing gas all up and through Europe. Can you believe that? All up and through Europe, apparently they be doing laughing gas for years. My doctor told me, he said, over there in London, everybody was doing laughing gas. Laughing gas, laughing gas. I'm, I'm, th these ladies up in there talking about, ah, ah. Like, that's probably what they're doing in there. Can you imagine being up in there? Can you imagine? Let's set the scene. Can you guys imagine? Can you guys imagine being up in there, right? You up in there? Put my la I feel a contraction coming. Put my laughing gas on. Put my laughing gas on. Oh! <laughs> Could you imagine that? That would be incredible. I'm like, when I read that laughing gas was an option, I almost thought, I'm like, I'm about to, hello, I'm Kiki. I come to get me um my pregnancy because I heard that you all allow laughing gas. So I'm here to laugh. Let's get into it. I'll be up there like that, ready to laugh my ass off, literally. But then my doctor told me they don't do it. So now, my only options to dealing with this pain is to have, uh, get on with the morphine. That seems like a jump. Either I'm doing the morphine or the epidural. And again, America blows me with this. Because y'all are happy with, y'all are okay with the morphine, but y'all not okay with the laughing gas? I can't laugh in there, but I can be like this. The hell? So I'm pissed about that. So my only choice is, is that. Natural, you know, natural birth epidural. But the way that these people are talking about it, you guys, they talk, the people that I'm talking to, I'm trying to imagine this like being damn near death because the way that these people are talking about this pain everybody i know and all the women that i know are still so strong they're like able to just do anything and they like girl you're gonna want that epidural and i'm like damn 
it's that intense. So just know, y'all, when this all goes down, I'm going to be telling y'all everything. When this all goes down, I'm going to let y'all know I'm not going to hold back. I'm going to keep it real with y'all and let y'all know if this really was bad like that. Okay? Because the way that they're saying like this, it's got Miss Girl shook, but ain't nothing I can do. I got to let him out. I got to let him out. My, my sister over here telling me something, free my nephew, free my nephew. So, I got to let him out. I got to let him out, honey. And I don't want to be up there on that table looking like Freddy Cougar just got to be talking about some guts everywhere. I mean, hey, if that's what it would take, then I guess that's what I have to do. But I don't want it to have to go there. I don't want to be looking like Freddy came in there. Ha. Ah, that would be just so spooky. <laughs> you have to laugh, y'all. You have to laugh, y'all, because that is so scary, like for real. Y'all have to y'all have to laugh, child, because it's very scary. It's very scary, you know. Um but each step that you go, you just, you know, take it one by one. Take it one by one. Hold on. Okay, I got to call my girlfriend. Let me call my girlfriend real quick. Just making sure that she's still down to go. About to call her, let her know. You guys, y'all cracking me up. What's up, everybody? I live for Viola. Viola Davis just got the EGOT. Praise God. We got to turn this on. This is going to me to sleep a little bit. I hope my girl don't cancel on me. Hey, boo. Oh, no. Hey, boo, we still on, right? You know when you make plans with your friends and in the day of, you be like, I don't want to leave my damn house. If she doing that, that's fine. Hey, boo, we still, we uh, just called. Just called. We still on, right? We still on, right? See, she's still with me. Now me. Oh, guys. Hey, you know what? I'm about to freestyle. Cut, cut. Let's cut all the drama. Pull up a pull up a nice beat. Pull up a nice beat, cause I'm about to freestyle, y'all. We about to get a freestyle going. He about to pull up a beat, okay? And I'm just go off the dome. Y'all give me something to talk about. <laughs> Yo, y'all, this is a hot ass mess. I'm ready for this, though. Either way, we're going to be entertained, okay? Anyway, good or bad, child, we're going to survive it. Turn this up. Oh, you gave me an old school beat. Okay, y'all, so give me a topic. What am I saying? Okay, oh, you want me to freestyle by my Sims family? Okay, I'm going to just go off with what I can. If it, if it happens, it happens. So, I'm about to talk about my Sims family. Hey. I got a girl named April. She be chilling with Terrence. They be talking all night. They be doing the dance. That a girl named. <laughs> okay, wait, wait, wait. I gotta catch it again. Here we go. Wait, wait, wait. Here we go. Uh, 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 uh. I almost had some. I almost had some. I almost had some. Here we go. Mm. I got a girl named April. She be chilling with Terrence. They've been doing everything. They be doing the dance. Got a boy named Hakeem. They be over the street. She be around with him. Yeah, you know she a freak. Now, last week, she thought that she might be pregnant with a new brand new baby. She didn't really have it, so she had to get right. Called back Terrence. They was right there at the night. <laughs> Hey, hey, that's all right. Went on vacay just last week. I had my other two girls, Kara. Oh, here. Kara and Melinda, they don't like each other too well. They started a little... Why am I going so fast? I need to slow it down. I need a new topic. Give me a new topic, y'all, because this wasn't eating. That wasn't eating. I barely had something going, but we need to do We need to do something more. Give me another... He, he about to give me another beat, and let's, let me rap about something else, because the storyline went too strict, too, went too quick with that. We gave it... A, we got our feet wet. We tried it. But we could have got better. Pregnancy. Okay, pregnancy. Okay, pregnancy. Give me a pregnancy beat. 
just go what your mind tells you. Be, 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 you know, feel into the energy and go what your mind tells you. Okay, so we about to do, I'm about to rap about pregnancy. Okay, rapping about pregnancy. This should be good. Rapping about pregnancy. He's about to put, he, he really thinking hard on this, honey. He's thinking hard on, um, he's thinking hard on this. Um, they said, they told you to give me a little drill beat. You know, what's the name? Had a good little drill beat. Asian the Brat. She had a good drill beat back a while ago. Yeah, I might play Sims again later tonight. I just wanted to talk a little bit today. I wanted to talk to y'all, see how y'all was doing. I'm getting the hang of this Twitch thing uh, on my Sims game. What, what, what drill beat is it on? I ain't, I ain't, I ain't familiar with drill. What, what so drill is, is like, no, I know exactly, oh, I know you know exactly what it is. But I just want to know what particular artist that they might be. Do Asian the Brat instrumental drill beat. See what she got coming up. Because that might give me a little something cute. That might give me a little something cute. But yeah, my um, I'm getting into the Twitch. My homeboy Terrence, he got a whole thing that starts like a damn TV show on his on his Twitch. So just know, y'all, y'all was here before. Y'all was here before we got elite with it. So, cause in a, in a while, y'all, we gonna have us a little opening theme song. Don't even worry about it. It's gonna be we gonna have a theme song. We are gonna have a little overlay. We gonna get all our stuff together, and y'all was gonna be here to build it with me. Period. Okay. Right now, we're like literally we started from the bottom, but we're gonna be here eventually. So just know, y'all, y'all was here first. Period. Before we really got this together, child. Okay. Period. Okay, what is this? Turn this up. Uh, okay. This not bad. Here we go. So they told me y'all told me to freestyle about pregnancy. Um. So yeah, it's real true. I'm having a baby boo. I don't really know what to do. Your girl is shit. Woo woo. Hey, hey. She shook. Woo woo. Hey, hey. So I'm about to be a boy mom. I'm about to be going crazy. Me and my son about to be hanging out. Y'all know I'm about to be crazy. Hey, I don't know what to do or say, but I'm going to do my thug thizzle. Y'all know anyway. I don't know about the first thing about having a baby or having a C-section. I don't know what it is to mean to bust a baby out your boom tune. We, we, we guessing, but it's going to be okay. Hey, hey. So all I know is I got a couple options. I'm going to either do it natural or I'm going to be up in there fighting. They told me to take morphine. They said an epidural. Why can't I just be laughing like them girls up in London? Woo woo. I don't know. This beat ain't right. We need. I need another beat. I need another beat. Okay. Another beat. Another beat. I like the woo woo. The woo woo was good. I'm going to say anything this time. I don't really know what I'm talking about. I'm on Twitch with the homies. We going up right now. Hey, I don't even know the vibes. I just be trying to get in where I fit in. You know it's live. Hey, your girl a Virgo. She got a cancer rising and a Sagittarius moon. She in a good vibe. She trying to figure out what y'all trying to do. Ooh, um, got my homie with me right now. We hanging out. He playing games and I'm here with y'all talking about everything from here to there. I don't really know. <laughs> Somebody said keep cooking. Uh, uh, you know what? Whatever y'all throw out, I'm going to have to rap about. Any subject that y'all throw out, I'm just going to try to like catch a vibe too. Hey, cooking in the kitchen. I don't make a lot of shit. I just be whipping. Sometimes pancakes, breakfast is my favorite thing. I like a little ramen. Y'all know what the thing things? Uh, my daddy just called. He said, Kiki, what you be doing at all? I said, hey, Pops, how church went today? I know you did a sermon and it went crazy. The Renaissance tickets, they be going live. I just sold my house so I could get it vibing. I'm trying to be in the front seats. I'm trying to say, hey, baby. Is you talking to me? Uh, praise the Lord, He the greatest in the world. You already know on Sundays we be prayed up. On my down, on my knees, saying, "Hey God, can you let me know what I need to do right?" Hey, I'm on Spotify. Hey, somebody said Spotify. We're gonna send for it. 
Hey, Sims 4 is going up. Uh, uh, uh. Sims 4 going up, got me on my Twitch. I be playing games and you know we getting lit. My girl name is April and her man named Hakeem, but she got another dude in the back named T. For a minute, my mods was messing up. His privates didn't match his skin. That was really sucking. I had to fix it up. Got better. It splashes mine. Now my stuff is real live and now I'm getting on. Hey, let's talk about black history. Hey, 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 hey. Here we go. Uh. My girl Harris Harriet in the crowd. She know what free is all about. She never played no games with her folks. She always had our backs, and that's why we really stole. Hey, that didn't really, really match. But one thing I like about damn black history is hard to let me see what I can say. Hey, hey, my man Martin. Here we go, we go, Martin. My man Martin Luther said he had a dream. He was doing his thing and we getting freed. Every day I be thinking to myself, I wish Black History Month was about this. Let's stop doing everything Black made. Then we actually would see how the Black made. Everything that we did that we love. If we didn't have them, we would really be stuck. Oh, that drop! <laughs> 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 Yo, y'all, I'm so weak. I'm so weak. Why did he hype me like that? That was crazy. <laughs> but y'all, I really do be thinking about that. I really do be thinking about that to myself. That like, you know, how could we make even? How could we even go give another tradition to Black History Month? Like, wouldn't that be crazy if we could? Um, if we could do something with Black History Month, like. Don't use anything that a black person made or has something to do with creating. I mean, if you could imagine, I mean, sometimes that could be dangerous because a black person created open heart surgery. A black person created street lights. A black person created what the, the actual tools that we needed to have a cell phone. So we actually would be shit out of luck if we didn't do that. But I, I just thought to myself, man, that could be kind of dope to really bring it to your attention that all the things that black people contributed it would be dope. I mean, like I said, we would need to use the, the 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 street lights because, come on, we don't want people having accidents. But if there was a way that we could just bring a t more attention to all the things that, you know, in Black History Month that black people contributed to, it could be crazy dope. You know what I mean? Just to remind you, like, yo, black folks really created a lot of stuff. Because I think as crazy as it is, a lot of people don't, um, a lot of people don't realize actually all the things that black people contributed. Like I said, like I'm, pr I'm pretty sure the refrigerator as well. Could you imagine a world where you just didn't use the refrigerator, didn't use stoplights, didn't use cell phones, didn't use, um, you know, open heart surgery? Like, that would be insane. So, anyway, shout out to Black History Month. You always got to show love to our black people. Amen. Period. Oh, okay, guys. So my homegirl, she didn't text me back. I hope she didn't ditch me. Oh, my gosh. I hope she didn't ditch me, girl. Because, oh, she did text me back. Okay, boom. She did. She said, yes. Sorry, I stepped to the um, bathroom and missed everything. Let me call her back. What's up, Switzerland? How you doing? Hey, Miss, hey, miss Girl. Yep, I'm about to head over there too. Yep, so it's it's close to me. So I'm, I was just making sure we were still meeting. <laughs> okay. Okay. Okay, no problem then. Love you. See you in a minute. See you soon, boo. Okay, guys. I guess I got to get off here in a few minutes because my girl is... But she's a little bit of ways away, so I can maybe chill for a couple of more minutes. But um, my cat, where's Jackie at? You don't come out. Oh, my gosh. I want her to come out for y'all so bad. She's so mean. Jackie! Woo, her ass was acting crazy, y'all. I thought she was going to kill my damn baby. Let me try to find her real quick. Two seconds. Jackie. Jackie, mama. 
No. She ain't coming, y'all. Jackie, she's she's really Jackie really is very stank. Uh, she's very Jackie is very much a stank booty girl. By the way, have y'all ever seen this movie called Twa? Child. Tell me please if y'all seen this movie called Twa, honey. I need to hear if y'all done seen this movie Twa. I haven't, I haven't, I never heard of it, I never heard of it, no, I haven't, yes, some people said no, some people said, so it's called Twa, it's like, it's like the end of Menage Twa, but it's called Twa, now this is an old movie, and by old movie, I mean like, it was done in the 2000s, right, and it was done in the, in the 2000s, which now is obviously like 23 years ago, which is crazy. But anyway, it's called Twa, T-R-O-I-S. And honey, it's starring Miss Kenya from Real Housewives of Atlanta. Kenya, Kenya's beautiful, but she when you look at her in this movie, you're like, Miss Girl, you had these brothers out here to choke hold. Because she was looking so gorgeous. It was like... Yes, Kenya was starring in this movie. Miss Kenya Moore, honey, was starring in this movie, honey. And she was, when I looked at her, I was like, I was like, Miss Twirl, mama. She started in this movie called Twa, honey, okay? Let me tell y'all about this movie because you ain't even getting into it. I ain't even told y'all nothing, okay? So, Miss Kenya was star is starring in this movie called Twa. Make a long story short, the whole movie is about this lady, husband, Kenya is the lady, and her husband is wanting to have a menage a toi. Okay? That's what the movie's about. Now, you can get the movie easily on, I don't know, did we watch it on Tubi? I think I watched it on Tubi. Go ahead, open up Tubi, okay? So, Miss Kenya Moore in this movie, she's starring as this lovely wife. And she's a very sweet wife, honey. She actually, her hair was kind of like this in the movie. And she was just like always giving us this. She was like, oh my gosh, honey, I love you, husband. Whatever that you need, husband. You know, she was very sweet to her husband. She was very sweet to her husband, lovely to her husband. Her husband kept begging her, begging her, begging her, begging her for a menage a trois. It was just like crazy. He just every day he was like, please, babe, I want to just like do a menage a trois, do a menage a trois, blah, 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 blah. So finally, Kenya's character was talking on the phone to her friend. The friend she was talking to also played Ronnie in Players Club, so you know she couldn't be trusted. Make a long story short, she talked Kenya into being okay with doing a menage a trois. Kenya, honey, she had the menage. And by the way, her husband was that one fine man that used to be on. Law and Orders or something like that. I forget. He was that man that was back in the early 2000s that had that sandy brown hair and them colored eyes. He was light-skinned. He was, like, always the sexy man. Anyway, he was kind of like a Michael Ely type. Anyway, so they were, um, they ended up having this menage a trois with this one lady. And the lady started being crazy. The lady started being crazy. She started, you guys got to watch this movie. It's very crazy. It's very old school. It's giving, but it's very old school. It was very good. It's called Twa, but it's like that old school vibe. So you got to get into it. Um, You got to get into it. Too. It's very interesting, but it's called Twa. Um, and it's on very 2000s. Like, I mean, the quality, you're like, wow, this was filmed on at actual film that's how old it looks um but very good very good little gaggy gag worthy movie very just like oh you know what i mean like oh okay um what other movies and good things have i watched lately that i could get y'all into um hmm i 100 percent watched knock at the who what you was gonna mention was it that don't die Oh, yeah, we did watch Dead Don't Die, the Blue Bill Murray and Adam Driver one. We watched that one the other night. We be watching movies all the time. And also, Knock at the Cabin, 
Just watch that in the theaters. Just watch that in the theaters. Now, what is a letterbox, y'all? What is that? What is a letterboxed? Because I can get into that. I love watching movies. The menu. So tell me what y'all thought of the menu. So who, who, who saw the menu? Because let's get into it. Let's get into it. I'm going to really get into my critic bag right now. This is no nothing crazy to the people that was in it or anything like that. I just really love to dive into, into movies and stuff like that. And so I really want to get into the menu because I think for me, I like the menu, right? But then at a certain point, I felt like they kept beating me over the head with the same message um where it was like okay i get it you know what i mean i was like okay i get it like you know these rich people suck you know what i mean i was like but like what else i'm going to get from it you know what i mean i just was like trying to figure out where else i was going to go um so i liked the movie right but and then her like i wanted to know what was the reason for her to eat the burger at the end you know was what they, they kind of saying sometimes all you need is a good cheeseburger like or was that kind of like the the, the metaphor was kind of like we do all of this extra stuff, trying to be so fancy, trying to be this and that, trying to look for all this validation, trying to be on, on this elite scale that none of it makes sense. And at the end of the day, a cheeseburger is still better. And, you know, I feel like maybe that was the vibe, but it just kind of got it just kind of got like wrapped up to me. She went back to his roots. But it's like, was that really all that? Oh, sorry. There are spoilers for this. Sorry if y'all didn't see it. I'm so sorry. Ugh, I should have let y'all know we was going to get into that. But yeah, I don't... Excess leads to death? Okay. It was just very extreme, but I mean, obviously, that's what a... I don't know. Exactly. Spoiler learning. Yeah, spoiler alert, y'all. But yeah, I don't know. I mean, I didn't... Yeah. I don't know, guys. Yeah. I think it was a personal message instead of a broader one. Okay. Cheeseburger was symbolic of the chef's simpler times. Yeah, but it's like that was all that we were supposed to take from it? Was that all we were supposed to take from it? The menu was not scary, like no. But wait, what is a letterbox, guys? I'm gonna look it up. Is that another is that another application? Like is that another or is like can I do a letterbox within this? Oh my gosh, my girl Nora just texted me and said, you watch Twa? Yes, girl, she must be watching this. That's my best friend. I'm about to look up Letterbox right now because like, oh, that's a whole nother thing I got to make now, y'all. Y'all got me making something every week. Y'all got me making something every week. <laughs> every week I'm like, okay, here I go downloading something new. Um... But I just love talking to y'all and laughing with y'all about this stuff. So maybe, yeah, I, I do like rating movies. So I think I maybe will go ahead and give me a letterbox then. Because I love watching movies. I mean, like, I, I watch movies so much to the point where you guys will be like, girl, do you, you need to go outside. You know what I mean? Okay, guys, I'm so sad that I got to go, but I really was living for y'all. I'm going to let y'all know and keep y'all posted about this letterbox thing. You know what I'm saying? Uh, because that seems like a fun way for us to get into these movies. Because me and Darius watch movies like to the point of no return. So we love to chat about it and really get into it. Um, love y'all. I'm going to have fun with my girl, Crystal. And I will see you guys later. We need to go out on a, on a good song. But what's a good song for me to exit to? What song can I give y'all this exit to? See what he gonna play. It ain't bad though. What you gonna give me? Put on our girl B then. Yeah, this we can't go out to this. I gotta go to some more. I gotta find my get my getting out song. Hold on. I gotta get out. I gotta I gotta exit to a good song. This isn't one. Like what? Yeah, we got I gotta get I gotta say goodbye. Good. I gotta give a good luck. Turn it up. Turn it up. Welcome to the live Big Flood Talk Show. Yeah. Now this is what you exit to. Big Flood. Look. 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 You gotta make sure you work them shoulders if you want to do it. Hey! Hey, y'all! Oh, I told you.
I'll drink something that she was on. What? 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 You know what? Ain't after my show. You know I walk in. Ah, you know I. What? What? Bad enough. You know I walk in. 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 You know I